Hello there, how are you doing? Welcome back to Slam Motion. So guys, in today's video, we are going to discuss what happened to the original killer in Scream, Skeet Ulrich. Are you guys excited? So, let's get started. So keep up with me till the end, comment right below this video, subscribe if you still haven't, and turn on the post notification for more videos. Skeet Ulrich was one of the original killers in Scream. Fans of the Scream franchise have learned to expect that, in the end, there are multiple killers hidden behind the creepy, ghost face mask. In the first film of the franchise, Scream, the killers were revealed to be Sidney Prescott's boyfriend, Billy Loomis, and their mutual friend, Stu Mocker. Ulrich recalled that before shooting, he didn't realize there was supposed to be humor in the story, which led him to think some of his co-stars were ruining the film. I think part of it was Billy and me getting into that mindset. During another interview, the Jericho actor remembered, I saw it as this very serious documentary about two killers in high school, and I was researching serial killers and their psychology of them, so I didn't really key into the humor of the story until day one. He yeah, added that the cast had fun together. That movie was so close to not even happening, and we were in Napa Valley feeling like some independent film. We shot, I think, five weeks of nights to start. It was so much fun and yet so dark at the same time, both literally and figuratively. What happened to Skeet Ulrich? When Skeet Ulrich appeared in Scream, it looked like he was on his way to the top. Ulrich had also appeared with his Scream co-star, Ned Campbell, in The Craft and can also be seen in the Oscar-winning film, As Good As It Gets, but several of his scenes were cut from the film. However, his next few films were flops, and soon he wasn't as in demand as he had been. Although Ulrich seemed to nearly disappear from the industry after the late 90s, he was still working. He had roles in Law & Order, Eli and Jericho, and also worked on several TV movies, including Gimme Shelter and I Am Elizabeth Smart. Ulrich discussed what he's been up to since 1996's Scream with the AV Club. Discussing his career when he took on 2003's Miracles, Ulrich said, I was sort of falling by the wayside a little bit in the film. My kids had been born, my twins, and I'd taken a year off, and I'd done a couple of movies I probably shouldn't have done, in a career sense. Miracles was my first stint in TV. But when I read that pilot script, I was just blown away and had to be a part of it. Ulrich also spoke about how the cast members of Jericho developed real friendships on the set. That became a real family, that group of people, and I think it was felt from an audience perspective. About 2017's Austin Found, he said, I just fell in love with the story. I think it has such an interesting take on today's culture, our obsession with fame, and how it can overshadow parenting. The actor stayed busy and was eventually cast on Netflix's hit show, Riverdale. I love that group, Ulrich said. Recently, the actor has returned to the Scream franchise and appeared in Scream 5 and Scream 6. What has Ulrich said about working on the film Scream? Some fans have described Scream as a perfect horror movie. What has Skeet Ulrich, one of the original Ghostface killers, said about making the film? During one interview, Ulrich revealed his favorite line from his Scream partner in crime was one Matthew Lillard had ad-libbed after having a phone thrown at him, also unscripted. Ulrich accidentally hit his co-star with the phone and Lilliard says, you hit me with the phone, you dumb. Discussing the moment, the actor recalled, it wasn't scripted that he gets hit by a phone, it wasn't scripted that he has a reaction to it. He continued, I was venting at having lost Sydney at that moment or knowing where she was, and the fake blood was so sticky that when I went to throw the phone just in frustration, it didn't go in the direction I intended in what you see. It hit him, and his reaction was in the moment. Ulrich even created two rooms for himself during shooting, one for himself and one for his character. During an interview with the AV Club, Ulrich revealed, the hotel suite they gave me had two rooms, so I used one just to sleep and the other one. I turned the other room into Billy's room. So guys, this was all about today's video. Share as much as you can, that really motivates us to create more content for you guys. With this, we end our video. Hope you liked the video. 